Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video of Jurassic World, the game. And today, um, I want to talk about a few things before we actually do the tournament, but um, I'm going to start making videos again. I I really want to make a video. I'm, I know I keep saying it, but there really hasn't been much in the game. I've been kind of busy. Like, quite recently, I was on Tennessee. I was on vacation. I was um, didn't have any Wi-Fi, which kind of stunk. Um, I'm going to go through that real quick. I was going to make a video on a few different things while I was there. But, um, yeah, guys, I had no Wi-Fi. We got there on, I think, I don't remember what day it was. I, uh, but, but we left yesterday on Thursday. We've been there for... I don't know how many days, but two days we had no power, which, terrible. Um, basically, we had a really big snowstorm. It wasn't like a blizzard. We had about like maybe six, seven inches of snow, uh, somewhere around that range. Um, so I just, I really don't know, but the power lines seem to have uh, kind of pulled down a little bit. And then the power went out um, for a few miles. This happened around maybe 9, 10, 10 at night, you know. So, the house got cold very quick. And, um, it was not good at all. Wait, did I not throw in... Oh, shoot, it doesn't count. On a, I was When we were driving back, I put some things in here. Oh, that's terrible. <sighs> <clears throat> yeah, I put in, like some uh hybrid or something i don't remember which one it was but that kind of stinks that it did that but um yeah guys the whole trip it got cold so at 11 to 10 to 12 o'clock at night we were actually playing cards in the basement with a flashlight and um yeah it was a uh, very cold the temperature drops very quick you think oh you have insulation in the walls and the fireplace upstairs still works because it was gas um i don't know if it runs on electric but it had a little dial on the wall and if it of course we disconnect but um if you actually um left the dial and it went off itself then it wouldn't go back on so i'd assume there was some electric involved with that but we kept having to turn it before the hour was over um but yeah it stunk because we had to keep doing it eventually it did go off at night then the next day look oh the power is on for about an hour and then boom it went back off again until five o'clock but by then we actually you know right after i went off we went out got breakfast went to a few stores so you know it was fine and we got back and boom everything was good but um yeah guys i was actually making a ton of tiktok videos um of opening pokemon cards so i'm gonna put my tiktok on screen and in the description so if you guys want to like follow me please do I'm trying to get a thousand followers on there as well i think it'd be cool um if we do do that um but yeah so right now, we're actually going to be doing this tournament for this brand new dino. Now, the last tournament, I don't think I even did or even finished. I can't remember what it was. <sighs> but, uh, yeah. I am really, really exhausted. The whole time on the vacation, I really got no sleep. The first night, my parents woke me up early because we went to go eat breakfast. The uh, second day, um, I think I woke up early can't remember why then i um i believe when it got when the power went out i woke up very very early because it was freaking freezing in the house and then uh yesterday i can't remember i don't remember every single day but yesterday before we left they woke me up at like 6 30 in the morning because there's supposed to be more snow in tennessee yesterday and it would have snowed all day and we didn't want to get snowed in so we ended up leaving but uh yeah so that was the crazy trip um i guess we could talk about something else i've actually been opening quite a bit of pokemon cards um but for some reason in florida there is a limit to how many cards you could buy at uh, barnes and nobles and gamestop and all the other stores but um i do want to talk about something um there is one store that i did go to i'm not going to say the name because i don't want to bad mouth them on the internet but I was going to buy... Their limit was three cards per pack. Um, they originally maybe around 3 or $4 I bought. I went back maybe a few days later to get more. The guy told me that they were like 3 $4. You know, somewhere around. I don't remember the exact price. But I'm like, all right, I'll take the three of them. Puts them on the counter. And he tells me, 
16. So I gave him 16 bucks. They're like, no, they're 16 each. And I was like, you just told me they were like $4 or something. And he's like, no, I didn't say that. They were 16. And you know what? It pissed me off because you know what? There were people behind me. There were people off the side because this place is like, it's like a nice comic book place. I'm never going back in there again. And we just lost them. But um, it was so embarrassing. He wasn't being nasty or anything, but you know what? It was just the way, you know, it was still it was insulting. How dare he? I'll get revenge on him one day, but not right now. But you know what? You don't tell someone they're like $4 each, then all of a sudden they're 16 each. <laughs> and, you know, it's just really, really embarrassing. I, I don't know. It just was. And then I ended up just like walking out, but you know, but still... You know, I think I don't think it's like a company like business where it's like a chain. Like for example, you have Walmart's, Targets, Petco, GameStop. I think it's a family-owned business because it's the first time I've ever heard of the store. Well, it's not the first time. I've been there many times before to get Funkos, but um, it's um, it's odd. It really is, because like that's the only time I've heard of the store, so it has to be family-owned. So they're just like freaking making up prices off the top of their head, which is very bad for business because. You know, it just is. You don't change prices right on the spot just to get more money. And I will never spend $16 on a Pokemon card pack unless it's something that's worth it. Like, and you're guaranteed to get all good things. You know, I'm just saying, in general. Um, I don't know. It was insulting. But, uh, yeah. <clears throat> all right. Let's see. Hmm. We made it to Prey League. Um. Oh, my teeth are killing me. I just woke up, too. Um. I haven't brushed my teeth yet. I was gonna, you know what I was going to do? I was going to get up, make the video, eat something, then brush my teeth. Because you know what? I hate having to, like, go and do all this crazy stuff all the time. Because you know what? I don't like having to, you know, just brush my teeth first and get my teeth dirty by eating again. So you know what? I just figured I'd brush after I eat. <sniffs> you know. And if you guys want to do that, it is a very smart thing to do. You're better off doing it like that. <sighs> so tired. Um, Hopefully, we win this round because there are two carnivores. That... Look, we're being countered by everything. Wow, okay. Um, I think he needs like four to kill us, I would think. Maybe three. He has two. Um, all right, all right. One, two, three. Four. I gotta go to work today. I really dread it. But you know what? I only have two days of work this week because I was on vacation for the rest of the week. So you know, it's not a big deal. All right. Um. One, two, three, four, five. One. Does that kill him? It does. All right. Also, guys, Mega Aerodactyl has actually come to Pokemon Go, which is very cool. I'm just checking my streaks. But, uh, yeah. I'm really excited. <sighs> Freaking exhausted. <sighs> I've actually been playing Fortnite quite a bit. I was actually um doing the Battle Pass last night again. I'm on, like... I did all the original pages, now I have like five pages left. Only because um, you know, I'm trying to grind out the levels and stuff. I feel like the way they made the new like battle pass thing is a lot better than the old one. Like how they updated the game, how they changed a lot of things up. You know, it seems uh there are Mac chops spawning in the wild again, which not bad. I'm I'm checking Pokemon on my phone. Alright. Ooh. All right, we got this, I hope. I was not looking to see what he had. Um, we're just going to go for four, because why not? Yes, we killed him. Good. Arrow. I have 25 Aerodactyls I could trade for XL Candy. I'm just going to save all of them, because you know what? Why waste them? And I was going to transfer them, but I'm like, you know what? I want to max out a Hundo Aerodactyl if I get one. And, um, you know, I really uh, need it. All right, boom. Oh, we went up pretty quickly. 
So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna do the whole thing on camera. Most of it I'm gonna put off camera just so I can get higher and not have to keep talking in the game. Um, but yeah, let's do another round. This will be the last round. You know, I don't want to, I really don't feel like doing too many on video right now. Um, you, you, and we need a carnivore and boom. <laughs> oh man, guys. I really want to brush my teeth. Alright, um. Oh, they're getting stronger by the minute. Alright, one. I'm surprised they're this strong in this league already. Um, hmm. Alright, two. Alright, let's go for three. I'm gonna have to edit this and upload it right after, too. This is crazy. Alright, three. Um, all right. Hmm. One, two, three. One, two, three. Don't know how much that pterosaur has. Um, oh man. 900, one, two. I think maybe two or three would kill us. Ooh. I think we're still good because we have that carnivore left and we do have a herbivore there, which, you know, we'll probably, we will win this. We will win. All right. Three. Oh, no. I get afraid because, you know what? I see the timer going down. I think it's going to disconnect. And I hate that. I remember, You know what? This whole trip, this thing is disconnected so much on me, the game itself. Because, you know, I still go on to do my daily trade sometimes. And, um, you know, I was on the highway, too, driving back. And I just... I would get in, I would click something, disconnect. About six or seven times. And I wish they would make an offline mode to this game. That'd be like the greatest thing in the world. Because you know, if you make an offline mode and people are driving, they can like download the events while they have Wi-Fi. And then while they're driving, they can go offline and do the events like that. You know what I mean? It'd be such a cool thing. Like Pokemon Go should do that too. There's a lot of games that should do it. Like with Minecraft. You can play offline. You don't need to have Wi-Fi. It's just, you know, they would benefit from it. They really would. All right, we're in Hunter. Not bad. Oh, man. Um, should I upload this tomorrow or today? No, I'm going to put it up for tomorrow. Because you know what? The truth of the matter is... Oh, we got a lot of DNA here. No, but um, let's get some super hybrids. The thing is... um. If you post too late in the day, you don't get any views. Throw more of them in. Because, you know, why not? I mean, I'm never going to really use this for anything else. Um, super hybrid. Dang, I can buy a lot of these guys. All right. Um, would be good for the tournament, too. No. 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 Yeah, I'll throw in an indoor after too. I would like to start another one, but um, yeah, guys, if you guys like this video, please click click like, subscribe. I will see you guys later, and uh, bye.